Hey, Anthony. My name's Max. I just spoke with Danielle, and she said you would be the person to send this video to. So that being said, um, I'm really the general gist of this video is just to show you three simple things that might be able to help you guys out. Um, and all I ask in return is for a little bit of feedback. Um, you can either reply to this email and just let me know what your thoughts are if you have any questions, or you can give me a phone call at 850-838-6092. Um, that being said, let's jump right in. So today I'm going to kind of break down your website and your competitor's website just to show you uh, three simple things that you can do to your website in order to start ranking in Google for select key terms that are being searched by your customers each month. And I know that this term is being searched each month because I use this software called Arefs, and it shows me that this one term gets 400 searches every month. Um, so that's pretty crazy. Uh, there's two other searches that get searched, and so there's a total of 420 um, searches every month for a plumbing contractor in Somerville. And so even if you're just ranking here in this organic listing, uh, you'd still be able to bring in about 20% of the traffic, just still 84 people to your website every month. And a well-built website can convert about 40% of those uh, into phone calls. So that's an additional 33 phone calls every month. And so even if you're only closing about 50% of those, 16 new jobs every month, and then, of course, however uh, much your average profit is, I don't know if it's you know four hundred dollars. That's still over six grand um, per month coming in from here. So that being said, let's jump right in. So the first thing is content on your homepage. And so if we just copy everything that you see here, including these images and what they're saved as, and just all the content here on your homepage and we throw it into uh, this word counter. It shows me that you have right up to 600 words on your homepage. And so your site looks absolutely amazing. Um, Google typically wants about 1,500 to 2,000 words on your homepage. And the reason for that is Google looks at your website as a contributing factor to their platform. And so the bigger your website gets, the bigger their platform gets. And then they will reward you by ranking you for whatever your content is relevant to. So if you had 1,500 to 2,000 words, um, you'd meet Google's requirement. And if you had these exact match keywords in there, you'd start ranking for what your customers are searching for. Uh, just to kind of do the same thing with your competitor here. They have quite a bit of content here, um, actually 3,300 words but not all of that is targeting uh, these keywords here. And this is actually a back page, so even if Somerville isn't your main area, you could do like them and have a back location page of your Somerville plumbers, and then that's gonna help you rank that back page, and you can be bringing in leads from Somerville that way as well. Um, so I would advise getting at least 2,000 words on your homepage and targeting that, those exact key terms that way you can start ranking uh, that back page or your home page, however you want, uh, in the, that search for Somerville Plumbers. The second thing that I wanted to show you is backlinks. And really all a backlink is, is just one website linking to your website, which passes power and relevance. And so if we take your URL here and throw it into Arif's, this shows me that you have 11 backlinks coming from 10 different websites. Um, and so that's like a good start. You want these numbers to be pretty uh, one and one with each other, a good one to one ratio. Um, however, as you can see, you have some power coming in, but it's not very trusted. That's what this, uh, that's what this one right here means, is that these links are coming from uh, non-trusted sources. And so, they're usually probably spammy uh, or just not really relevant to your topic. And so basically what these uh, backlinks look like is this right here. And it kind of creates an avenue to the back end of your page that passes power and relevance. And so if I were you, I would get these links on like blog posts or um, 
you know, home improvement websites, stuff that's relevant, that's going to pass a lot more relevant power. Uh, if we do the same thing with your competitor here on their location page, they don't have any backlinks. All this juice is coming from their homepage that just kind of leaks over to the rest of the website. So it'd be really easy for you to target that and then uh, just get a few good quality links and you could outrank your number one competitor that way. The third and final thing I wanted to show you is how you get into this map pack here. And all that is is citations. And so what citation are is, is just a business's name, address, and phone number placed on various directories throughout the web, such as Yelp, Facebook, um, BBB. And what that does is it kind of verifies that you are a real business with a real physical address and that you um, are not just another website out there on the internet. And so once Google verifies that and you get more citations than these three, you can start ranking in this map pack. And that's important because these map packs get about 25% more clicks than these organic listings down here do. So that's really all that I have for you today. Um, I hope that this was informative and helpful. All I ask again is just for a little bit of feedback. You can either reply to this email or give me a phone call at 850-838-6092. So I appreciate your time and we'll talk soon.